The signature move in Atlas Fallen is the sand slide. It's so much fun to slide around, but the game never makes the most of it. You may expect a string of exhilarating chase sequences scattered throughout, or slopes that let you gather speed to launch yourself across the land, but you don't get either of these. Sand sliding is really only another way of running. It's both disappointing and indicative of a game that once you scrape away the topsoil, has little note to offer. So while the character movement is bold and slick, it's undercut by an unreliable camera and combat systems when you're trying to complete repetitive and unimaginative quests in a bland fancy world. It isn't a disaster, it's proficient in some respects, adequate in others and manageable at worst. If you're hankering for yet another open world action adventure, particularly for its co-op play, maybe you'll extract some joy from this sandbox, otherwise let it slide on by. As such, we've given it a distinctly middling 2.5 out of 5.